Welcome back to Doom. Let's finish up the original trilogy. Let's start with Mount Erebus. This level does have our secret exit of the episode as well. Ow! God damn. <laughs> you just interrupted a guy's conversation with his dead friend. Oh. Oh, Bilson. Bilson McWilson, my best friend. <laughs> Your best friend's parents sound like assholes. Finally got my chainsaw, so may as well use it a bit. Can't reach those, though. I wish you could throw the chainsaw in this game. <laughs> Just have it on a wire. Just fucking yonk! Hurl it around. Oh, that'd be sick. Doom Eternal seems to have some fucking whack weapon, so maybe it'll be in that. Who needs a mace on a chain when you can get a chainsaw on a chain? That pinky is tearing some shit up. The, the, Listen to the carnage. Clawing noise is so awful. It's very scratchy and painful. It sounds like it's peaking awfully. It's the worst. This room here has kind of what you were talking about in the last episode, Thorne. Just, just the, the skin on the walls there. I don't, I don't think skin is blue and red, but I'll take your word for it. Not this wall. <laughs> the one inside. <laughs> if your skin looks like this, please go see a doctor. Please see several doctors. <laughs> Just run into a hospital and scream. Ah! Basic protocol. Please, no, you gotta sit in the waiting room and wait. I really like this level, though. It's uh, kind of reminiscent of Doom 2, in a way, because it's very large and open. Hi. But that skull wall is pretty sick. Very much. I want to I want to build my house out of it. Oh, these lost souls are just having it out. Oh man. Can't really tell they're there. Oof, here's the situation room. This is uh this is a bit rough. It's okay. We got the invincibility and the BFG, so. Don't eat my chainsaw. It's a caco's job. Hmm. <laughs> this fucking music is ridiculous. It is. It's not very cool, is it? No. <laughs> like some of Doom's music is pretty cool. This part is pretty cool, but not the song as a whole. <laughs> Little imps dancing in a cage here. This level has a lot of interesting secrets, actually. We'll get to those later, but they feel more choreographed. Oh, God, fucking hell, I keep using that word. Telegraphed. They, they, telegraphed, yeah. <laughs> Teaching these walls to fucking dance. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, how the player won't find me unless they hump this particular candle. <laughs> <laughs> like this. Like that. Oh, there's another... Hey. Hey, buddy. Ah, oh, fuck. There's a lot wrong with what you just did, and I'm kind of impressed. There is a lot wrong, because what I just did made that chainsaw, which I believe is a secret, raise, so you can't get it now. So I just kind of fucked up this run. Up in here. It's fine, you acknowledge the secret, that's good enough for us. Oh Jesus, take care of him. I, sure, I'll, I'll pretend that's what's happening. Yeah, the bitrate on the... I'll just mention it, the bitrate on the preview video is very low. So it is, everything just kind of looks like a watercolor painting to us right now. Especially because you have a messy texture that is red and blue and glowing repeatedly. Yes. You know YouTube's compression, it's probably not going to look great in the final video either. Unfortunately, yeah. Unless you, like, render the bitrate too high to fail. Yeah. 
<laughs> Just like a terabyte video upload for a 30 minute video. Crush YouTube servers with a single video. Alright, so this button over here, it looks like it's it looks like it's already been pressed, but you actually have to unpress it in order to raise this. I'm gonna unpress this button, that sounds <laughs> very easy to do. Bunch of fucking crackalopes. I'm sorry, what? You heard me. I ain't repeating myself. Well, with you, Jacob, it's not whether we heard you. <laughs> Alright. Alright, so there's a fucking room over there. Let's head in here. I don't know what's in here, so we're gonna check it out. Oh shit, it's the exit. I'm not realizing it's the exit. Oh god, no! Oh my fucking god! No. <laughs> Fuck! Wait, how many secrets did I get? <gasps> no! <laughs> <laughs> Holy shit! Let's try that again. Let's head in here. There's a secret in here. Gotta undo your shame. So yeah, that's the regular exit. This does lead to a plasma <laughs> rifle secret. I am just astounded at how thoroughly you fucked it on that one. <laughs> For some reason my brain was like, this is obviously a trap, like in that other level. So each of these candles does hold a secret. That's how you know where the secret is in this room. Right. Yeah, this chainsaw is a secret, good. Alright. Back in here, we've already seen this situation, so we don't need to see this again. Situation is the right word for that. <laughs> yes. Got this fucking house. There's some way in. Here we go. I think that's my favorite activation sound for the uh, zombies. It's, it's oddly cute. Yeah, all the death sounds never sound that painful. They just sound disappointed. <laughs> <laughs> like the lost at the lottery. And the penalty is death. The lost souls don't even bother to scream. They just explode. All right, over here is the secret exit. I'm going to save over here. Every one of those A's is me accidentally <laughs> pressing enter instead of fucking end there. All right, so you are <laughs> you are able to run into this secret. So, fuck. <laughs> All right, I swear you can do that. So let's fucking try this again. Okay. LP my dude, uh, LP my dude. <laughs> okay, that's not the way I'm used to being able to get into this secret. This is how. Fuck you. This is how I normally do it. <laughs> yeah, you definitely did it. All right. All right, let's try this one more fucking time. Got to fucking wang your elbow on the corner, too? Like... This is significantly easier to get in. Alright. That's Mount Erebus. I really like that level. It's very open. Again, it's reminiscent of Doom 2, because Doom 2 has a lot of really open levels. But that's our secret exit that takes us to Warrens. Let's take a look. Hmm. Mm. This looks familiar. It's an eye. Yeah. This is... Looking very much like the first level of the episode. Even got the Kaka Demon, but this time we don't have just a pistol to take him out with. See, the bridge is gonna go down, yeah. Did you fuck something up? I, maybe I did. This looks like fucking level one, but with different music. Doesn't have Pantera playing this time. Why are you keeping my eye out for any differences? No, this looks exactly the same. Sure does. So then the question is, is it your fault? I mean, I entered the level, so I guess it is. I didn't hear. Alright, the real test is going to be seeing if the one secret of this level is still there. So let's check out that wall there. Come on. Yeah, still there. It's still got the rocket launcher. Oh well, that was easy. We just collect all this fucking health and get out of here. Um. Well, those rocket launchers and that soul sphere is foreboding. 
Or those rockets, rather. Hello? Oh, shit, there's a cyber demon. Let's take him out. Ah, a demon shaped like a friend. A big fucking deadly friend. Oh! <laughs> well... Only if you're bad at catch. Or good, really. I, either works. I am oddly bad at fighting the cyber demon in this LP for some reason. Let's try that again, though. But th it's okay. There's an invincibility over here, so in reality, this let's just chainsaw him. Chainsaw dick. If he'll let me get to him, that is. Chainsaw them buns. Cyber demon does have a very juicy ass. Okay, but I do like the idea of the cyber demon. Cyber demon just wearing. Just fucking booty shorts that says juicy on the ass. <laughs> <laughs> oh god, alright, it's ending. Gotta get out of here. We've had our fun. I could just use the BFG, but that didn't feel right. No, you just didn't think to use it. Shut up. <laughs> you ever think about shutting up? <laughs> Let's be real here! <laughs> ever considered shutting the fuck up? I don't know how to, it's a problem. <laughs> Getting too close to those explosions. It's okay, we're almost done here. There we go. God, it just explodes into a mist, and it's the best thing. That's Cyber Demon number two down, so now we gotta backtrack a bit. That's not the only difference between E3, M1, and this level. That also unveils some Kaka Demons. Oh, Jesus. Please, after defeating a Cyber Demon, don't die to two Kaka Demons. <laughs> No, that'd be hilarious. At 170 health. Baron can't see me. Well, well, he could for a second. Here. He's the real threat. We need to BFG him. It's over here. Oh, there's a Berserk. Always love these with the environmental suits. There we go. Yeah, you lost some health, but here, have this as payment. A way of saying we're sorry. <laughs> it is kind oh, of Oh, they're actually a lot easier it? to see like this. Yeah. It lightens everything up. The only thing improved by this. Alright, these guys can piss off. Ooh, three at once. That felt good. In my ears. Man, you are fucking plowing through those cells. I've still got a good amount. A few more BFG shots. It's it's four. You've got four more. For some reason, when you press that red switch before you have the red key, <laughs> it plays a little chick chick sound. Oh my god, there's so much here. This is BFG City. Speaking of four shots. Oh, fuck! Ow! Oh, I'm low. I'm not liking this right now. Oh my god, I can't even see them. I could just book it right now. I kind of want to fight those barons. Plus there's some cells over there that I desperately need. I have zero. Sometimes you just crave a murder. Okay. Speaking <laughs> of... <laughs> wow. Whoa. I felt that one on my ear hair. Why do you got their cells? It's probably the most treacherous I've ever felt in this level, or in this uh, game, rather. <gasps> we're good. Okay. And there's a soul sphere, so we're super good. And that doesn't activate a trap, thankfully. Nice that the Soul Sphere cleans your hair, too. Yeah. That blue stuff is actually shampoo. It also smells amazing. Gotta back up a little for some reason in order to open that door. Alright, that finishes up episode level 3, not 1. I do think that was actually a pretty neat use of a previous map. Yeah. A little simple little, uh, little trap. Gate to Limbo, just a pole. 
Gotta limbo to get to the boss. Come on, Doom Guy, join in! The xylophone's back. Uh, yes, the, ret re the return of the flank? My spine doesn't go backwards, does yours? I'm confused whether I even have a spine. Oh, sweet Jesus. I was more afraid of the fact that I was holding a rocket launcher as they were approaching me, rather than the fact that they were actually approaching me. <laughs> more dangerous to yourself than they are. Now, this level is very hard to navigate, but I can't say I don't like it. It is fun, and it's kind of fun figuring out where to go, but it is another level you'll spend a good amount of time in. Uh, like so. Here we go. This did something. Oh, yes. At least a pentagram of, of what to call them pinkies. Then, it, then, then the anagram would have worked, but... Fortunately... Just unleashed a ring of cacodemons. Alliteration, not am not anagram. God damn it. Oof. Look, English is fucking hard, alright? We should ban all words that start with the letter A. I understand completely as someone who's like super prone to spoonerisms. Spoonerisms? Yeah, it's a fun name to say, ain't it? It is. It's when you switch the first syllable of two different words. <laughs> Like cunning stunts. Ah, oh, yes. That's my favorite Metallica live album. And yeah, exactly like that. That's that's all it is, right? Yeah. yeah. That's all it is. Like Jiggly Jacob. Damn it. <laughs> <laughs> it's it's Jiggly Jacob, but I understand you messed it up. That little pinky room is the secret, so step in there. One hundred and ten percent chainsaw. So what if the real secret was the friends we made along the way? What friends are we making? <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Fist full of pinkies. In other words, secret zero percent. <laughs> <laughs> Secret 0% heart, 100% harp sound. <laughs> now, I'd argue it's more than 100%. Have you seen how many things you've killed? This is a big spooky room. A little big spooky button. <laughs> <laughs> I love how this cry was so far away. <laughs> I didn't even hear it. Oh! <laughs> That was beautifully timed. Bar There's something about Barons of Hell. They're so much less scary when they're r way over there. <laughs> you did it. There we go. You solved the puzzle. Thought I fucked myself there. Watch out for this room. Hi, friends. Oop. Missed the first rocket. Now now they're going to go back to being dead dead, and they're going to make fun of me. I'm glad you felt the pistol was most appropriate. Uh, I did. Thank you very much. Oh, sweet Jesus. I should be saving those. There's going to be a lot of hurting floor around, but I guess I'll take them all. Nope, you get every single one trying to avoid the cacodemon. <laughs> Radiation suits do not stack, by the way. So you they the timer just resets every time you pick one up. That's that's incredible. There was a BFG in that room though, so if you still haven't gotten one, feel free. Somehow. Oh, don't worry, we can... <laughs> Hey, look at all these suits. I'll only take one. Save the rest. I think you took two. Did I? Oh, whatever. <laughs> 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 oh, 
I got you! Playing it real conservative with those suits, ain't you? <laughs> I might have to go back down there. But we got the red key and we've been finding a million red doors. Actually, just opening one of those red doors opens a lot of them throughout the entire level. Man, look at these losers. And here by the yellow door. Man, we're not going there until the end of the level. You gotta live in the here and now, Lost Souls. Yeah, I fucking told him. Yeah, you, you got him good. I don't have a yellow key. Where is it? Uh, I'll take your word for that being yellow, given the fucking green filter over everything. Yeah, right. Oh, there we go. There's a yellow key. How do I get it? There's a million fucking teleporters, and it's very difficult to remember where goes where. There we go. That opens the bridge to the yellow key. I guess I didn't notice the staircase that was there that could have just led me to it. Whatever. But over here, shit. Gotta get a running start. Wait. Gotta get a running start. Fuck. <laughs> Alright, run over here and get this secret. Alright, back over here. This allows us to raise the bridge to the fucking exit. And we're out! <laughs> <laughs> Sorry! I, I lost it a little bit. I couldn't... Matt. Alright, Gate to Limbo is fucking done. Now y'all ready for this? Fucking felt like the Gate to Limbo. <laughs> gate to Limbo, surprisingly wet. Alright, here's the final level of the original Doom. This song rules. Get ready to LP your Duda. And, who is our final boss of the original Doom? Why, it's none other than... This big screaming bitch, it's the spider mastermind. She's a big krang looking motherfucker with a super chain gun. She can tear you up. She fucking hates your guts. I also really like her cry. There's also a few other enemies to kind of deal with. Just a cacodemon and a baron of hell. Yeah, but they're fucking whatever compared to her. <laughs> yeah. There is actually a very easy way to take her down. I'm going to show you that later. But for now, let's go ahead and do it the hard way. Take her down with a plasma rifle. Or at least try to. I'm at 2% health now. <laughs> How's that armor working out for you? <laughs> oh, it's doing great. Let's try that again. Again, I am doing this the hard way. In reality, keeping it real, guys, the spider mastermind is very much a pushover. But let's, I don't want, I want to make her feel good at first. So I'm going to, I'm going to have a little bit of a struggle first. Build her up before you break her down. Exactly. Got to let her down easy. Make her feel important. All right. Did it. <laughs> that shit eating face. <laughs> Look at that son of a bitch. <laughs> Fuck it! Do it the easy way! Got you good, bitch! I fucking heard you talking shit like he wouldn't hear! One, two, three! That's fucking it. It is actually possible to take out a spider mastermind with one BFG shot if you're close enough. Finally, back on Earth. Yes, finally at last. We have stopped the fucking invasion of hell. We've kept it on Mars, and everything's cool. Yeah.
Look at this adorable rabbit. Aw. <laughs> the adorable rabbit playing a recorder. That rabbit is strong and our friend. Not strong enough, apparently. Well. <laughs> so, that is a city on fire, but in front of it is the head of a rabbit, a very important rabbit. This is Daisy, Doom Guy's rabbit. Pour one out for your girl, Daisy. So this was supposed to set up Doom 2, and it did, but this plays into the bonus fourth episode that was added in the Ultimate Doom, which actually came out after Doom 2. So it's kind of like a middle episode between the two of them. So in the next part, we will start that. Thy flesh consumed. Munch, munch. Rest in peace, Daisy. Best damn fucking rabbit that anybody ever did see. They left behind a dollop, a dollop of Daisy. <laughs> Why do you have to sing at my funeral? <laughs> <laughs>